Hi, my name's Mark Oliphant and I'm the boarding house master at Newington College. Welcome to Edmund Webb House. Come inside, I'd like to show you around. In my opinion, the factor that sets boarding apart uh, at Newington College is the fact that we have four academic staff members that live in the boarding house. Um, and of course, I live here with my family, my, my beautiful wife and my sometimes lovely young son. Having families that live in the boarding house creates more of a community uh, within the house because uh, Thomas and, and Carla go down and, and they eat with the boarders regularly, you know, every night they would eat with the boarders um, in the boarders dining hall. Um, and that makes us more approachable for the boys um, and it also creates a, a sense of family for them beyond the families that they have at home. Uh, they now have an extended family here in Utah. My name is Matt Hardman. Uh, I come from Yamba on the far north coast of New South Wales. My experience of boarding since starting this up in January of this year has been really positive. Uh, I have a great group of guys around me in the house. Um, it's a small boarding house which brings a pretty good atmosphere. There's a quite a range of cultures in the house, some international, some from the country, some from coastal towns such as me, as well as um, people from Tonga, and then the people that just live that on the border of Sydney. What I've enjoyed most about boarding this year is the great group of guys around me. You've always got sort of someone to hang out with or something to do, as well as being so close to school, it makes it things so much easier with homework and everything because you're just so close, as well as the number of outings that we've sort of done. It's just made weekends really enjoyable and boarding a great experience. Next to the boarding house is the Wyvern Preparatory School uh, and of course we have access to those facilities. So what you can see behind me here uh, are a couple of AstroTurf courts, basketball courts that can also be set up to play tennis. Uh, the boys often play touch football on them and as you can see behind me right now they're playing bigger on them. The greatest advantage of boys in boarding and socialising that they're, in a sense, almost forced to get along with one another and their friends become like that support network that they have straight up. Uh, and the best way that the boys support each other and, and get through those tough times that they go through is they go and hit a ball around, play some touch footy or, or kick a soccer ball. Hi, my name is James Norman. I teach uh, technology and my role in the boarding house is I'm assistant boarding master to Mr. Oliphant. Boarding is an all-encompassing thing. Yeah, it's it's all part of your life. And you know, if, if you know, not one of us boarding members of staff just says, "Oh, those are my hours that I work." We're always here. I mean, you know, if someone's got a problem with design and tech, if someone's got a problem with English, they're going to see, well, if someone's got a problem with science, then they're going to see Mr. Oliphant. So we're pretty much always on call, but it's not really being on call because it's sort of more of a family feeling here. So every um, uh, assistant master's on duty one weekend in three. Um, we take the students to um, a range of activities in Sydney, some of which include um, trips to Bondi Beach, um, trips to Bondi Westfield, We've also been to Leichhardt Markets um, and uh, we also go to the cinema, um, the Dendy down in Newtown um, and often I take the boys for ice cream to Calamoon on um, Enmore Road. The level of trust between the boys and the staff is high and so I think that as well as round, well-rounded individuals for, for students, we have that with staff as well, and all of us get on really well. If I could take anything away from the boarding house, I'd say it'd be the level of camaraderie that will then print on your child's mind for the rest of their life. My name is Matthew Watson. I am boarder in uh, Year 11 going to Year 12 for 2013. The reason I'm boarding is because my parents are living in Abu Dhabi. 
Um, I was at Newington in year seven and a bit of year eight before moving over there and then moved back for this, these last years of school to get a better result, I guess, for my last two years. Being the boarding house, I do have really strong friendships with the housemaster. I think the best way to put it is that it opens up a huge world of possibilities. We're five k's in the city and it's just really easy to get everywhere and stuff, like go to Newtown for a movie or something and it's a really social atmosphere. The benefit of being small, I guess, is that when it comes down to like, okay, if we want to get out to the beach, we're able to organise like a fleet of buses to take us down there. It's literally just Coach Nordich says, okay, I need to, he has the keys for um, the school bus, and yeah, it's we can come up with like an idea to go out somewhere. And five minutes later, we can pretty much be on the bus and going and stuff. So you don't have to go chasing around for 200 words or something. It's like the 30 of us or so here on the weekends means that we can just sort of ask around, and that sort of tight web of like communication is really unique and it means we just get things done and have fun. I hope you've enjoyed this brief insight into life at Edmund Webb Boarding House. But to experience the difference, you really need to come and visit so that I can introduce you to my family at Newington College.